Hi everyone, it's Kel and Rich, and we're back with you. A little introduction, my name's Rich, this is my wife Kel. Hi there. And we love providing first reaction videos to everyone, metal, progressive rock, and anything in between. That's awesome. I'm a former musician, and then I became more of a music appreciator, going to live shows, brought that kind of life to my children. Eventually they became their own musicians, and that Flying V, Jackson King, between us, belonged to my son Jared, who passed away suddenly from complications of epilepsy about six months ago. My kids and I used to react to lots of music and videos, and now I do it with my wife, Kel. My name's Kel, and contrary to popular belief, about 95% of the music on this channel I have never heard. And the reason why is because as I was growing up and into my teenage years and my early 20s, I was working as a towards being a classically trained concert pianist and a music teacher. I played in symphonies and orchestras and bands and I was very sheltered, so I wasn't really encouraged to listen to anything except for what I was studying. And because my music studies were very encompassing, that meant that I didn't have a lot of free time to do what I wanted. So now on this channel with Rich and with all of you, I get a second childhood with music and I am loving every minute of it. I come home from work every day and the playlist is set and I have no idea what it is or who it is and it's just fantastic. So thank you for being here with us. We're staying with the heavy. We're staying with Testament. Mm. So we just did Judas Priest. Victim of Changes, 1983. Watch Love the video. It. Pretty cool. Watch the end, too. We we get pretty personal, I think, about how, how what's going on in the channel. You might want to check that out and see, yeah. see how it applies to you. This one's Over the Wall, official music video. Kel, back to Testament. Love these guys, and I don't know a lot about them. So this one is new to me as well. Oh, Great. About, about I'd say about a quarter of the music that we're listening to on this channel I've never heard either. Maybe even 50%, maybe even more, depending on the day. All right, here we go. Just going to share the screen and give us a little more room. I'll do the peering over the fence thing like I like to do, just so you guys can have the most amount of um, visual sight. Here we go. Alcatraz.
Well, you know what that mm -hmm. is. Uh, that's interesting. You have the mic, Kel. I loved it. I can't wait to say what I have to say. Um, usually when we are listening to something, most of you who have watched us before know that it takes me a few minutes to kind of find the groove, get into it. I felt like I wanted to pick up chairs and smash shit. It was good. I thought a mosh pit would have been good right here. Uh, I think they'd be awesome in concert. I think they're great. It was fast, high energy. How can you lose? It was great. Yeah. Yeah, it was awesome. As I was watching you, Kel, something really hit me. What's and that? it was totally like one of those <gasps> moments. I love those moments. I'll take you back, you and you guys. I'll take you back to somewhere around 1983. And I put on Kill 'em All from Metallica. Just bought it. And it was Metallica's first full album. They, they had demo tapes and things like that before. And I put it on, and I'm like... Because I wasn't into um, thrash at that point, and I, I just been starting to hear of it. But I, I wasn't... I listened to it, and I couldn't get ahead of it. It just... It, it felt just... Uh, you know, that kind of thing that's going on with thrash, right? <laughs> and I listened to it probably the album I listened to probably four times in a row like I just I just I, I there's something about it and I'm like oh my god I love this but I felt tired and I'm behind man I'm behind behind the beat I love it. And after the fourth time, I remember listening to Whiplash, and I got it. The light bulb went on, and I'm just like, I'm with them. And I watched you just now, and I can see you, like you said, getting used to it and getting almost with the music and almost ahead of it so that you can, you can be with it instead of, it's like something that you're catching. It's like, like, you got it. Right? Right? Exactly. Right? So, exactly. I, so I watched you and I was like, oh my God, that was me like 30 years ago. More. 83, 93, 03, 13, 36 years ago. He's having the exact same response that all of you are saying you're having when you're being blown back in time to the nostalgia. You're like, I remember when I was 13 and I was so, blah, 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 and it was so good and thank you for that. It was awesome. That's exactly what you just said. You had your nostalgic moment. Fun high five! We're in the time machine. High five. Yeah, just that, that's what Bill it was. Ted. <laughs> Excellent. Uh, I was watching you, and that's what happened. I yeah. was literally like, I remember that feeling because I saw you. Yeah. I can't wait to watch the video. And there was that moment where you're just like, like I could see you just getting in the pocket, right? Yeah. And, and you did. And Testament is very much like Metallica, right? I mean, do you, do, you, do you hear that or see that yet? No. Okay, all right, that's cool. I see I, Metallica I see as Metallica, Testament as Testament, Learen as Learen. I don't... I don't... Learen. Learen. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Hi, Canada. Canadian we didn't metal know, goddess. We didn't know that Learen Whoa. was metal goddess from that's Canada. That's like liquid maple syrup in her blood. Electrified liquid maple syrup. Yeah, and she's still touring. She's yeah, still, she still performing. Yeah, she just played in Calgary and Edmonton. Yeah. So, yeah, again, it's, it, bands are bands, artists are artists, everyone's unique. It's just, yeah. it's just a similar experience, a similar sound, a similar beat, a similar uh, rhythmic progression, a similar vocals. We won't get into that, okay? We won't get into better or worse. Not yet. It's, it's, it's all yeah. just, they're still all separate. Yeah. 
deliciousness for my ears. Yeah. So so very very cool. That was a breakthrough moment for me oh, because I'm so glad. I see you basically just getting the whole thrash vibe, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. That that's like the first thrashy song. That's that's super thrashy. I, I that believe. That was very good. I liked it I mean, a lot. How can that not be? Thrashy, thrashy. It was awesome. Thrashy, thrash. Um, yeah, I saw, I, the first time I actually saw you, like, instead of kind of having that that concerned look on your face, like some of the Slayer songs, uh-huh. <laughs> that one was that one was pretty cool. Thanks for sharing, babe. Mm-hmm. I love you so much. Lucky am I. I haven't seen him all day. Gone for a long time. So it's nice to be home with him and with all of you. Thanks, Kel. Thanks, you guys, for watching, hanging with us, and Thanks for being doing here. what you're doing. It's just it's yeah. fantastic. More to come. Bye. Later.